Hi everyone, my name is Heather and I'm the person behind Happy Puppy Truffles and today I wanted to share with you guys an update on my Animal Crossing New Horizons game for the month of March. Uh, March has of course lots of fun stuff in the beginning with Girls Day and then ends off of course with Easter but I had lots of fun things going on too with the Sanrio characters so that was cool. Um, so we started off here knowing that it's spring and there's new spring clothes available for purchase at the store. I put out a little bit of decoration for Hinamatsuri for the doll festival, so that was fun to have those out on the 3rd. And then it was just a really beautiful spring day, so I kind of changed my house and the sky looked so blue and the grass started getting greener and greener. And I decided it'd be fun maybe to do some island hopping to see which kind of characters I could get come to my um, island. And I met this cutie and so I decided to have her come to my town and um, decided that I was probably going to kick out Wade uh, to kind of have her have a chance to move in. Um, the only reason I really tried to do that was because I was really getting ready for the fact that the Sanrio Amiibo cards are going to be available and integrated into the game later in the month. So I thought it would just be fun to kind of goof around and see who I got. And she was really cute and I did invite her to my island, but she didn't stay very long because I did actually wind up in instead asking the Sanrio characters later on. But she moved into this house here, which was Wade's. So I just went over here to say goodbye to him. I have um, two characters that are the same kind of character type. It's him and also Sherb. And I thought that, you know, since I already have somebody of that other character type, we'd say goodbye to him. He's super adorable, but I have his amiibo card if I ever want to call him back. So I decided to send him on his way and um, then get the other little goat little girl to move in. And at this time when I was doing all this, I was also uh, changing the time on my device and so kind of time hopping and stuff. So some of the dates are very out of order of what actually is when I happened when this happened in real life. So you'll notice it says like March 17th and it was really not that day. Uh, but I went ahead and had everyone kind of move around and try to get people to come so that she could move in. And you can tell her place was just adorable. And I didn't realize, but she's a twin sister for that other little guy back there, her. Um, I actually saw her on the island too and debated inviting her first too, because they're both so cute. Now we did get to the real timeline here and of course we had St. Patrick's Day. So there was lots of really lots of great fun items that were included as part of this. I was a little freaking out because I hadn't gotten the recipe to make the magic wand that you see here but I finally got that so I was very happy to get everything. So that was a lot of fun. I love that day. Uh, but then one of the big things that happened this month was the announcement of the update and the release of the Amiibo cards in America for the Sanrio series. I had all these cards from before when I played on the 3DS. And so I was kind of really excited for the ability to bring these guys to my island. I'm a huge fan of a lot of them. Not all of them, I'll say, but I am a huge fan of a lot of them. So I was debating who I wanted. I knew I wanted her for sure because I really love her. I love little twin stars and then I just really like her as a character. So I knew I wanted to invite her and uh, when you use the amiibo cards to invite people it takes you three days because you invite them, they ask you to make something and then they say oh I like this place come in and invite me again and then you have to wait till the next day. And you invite them and they say hey I like you make me something. So you make them something and they're like yeah I really do like it here. Invite me again and then the finally the last time you invite them and they're like, okay, I'm here. And then if you do have a full house like I do of people, you can choose who they'll replace, which is really nice because other times when you have a character that is there that came from the campsite or from the island, you, they just randomly choose who they're going to replace. And if it's not who you want them to replace, you have to restart and try again. And that can be frustrating. So the cards are really nice, but they do take a lot of time. And I, at this time, I actually just jumped ahead in time so I could get her because you can tell like her place is so pretty. I love all that stuff in there. All the little twin star stuff is so cute. So, uh, but then later on for the other characters that I did actually wind up inviting to my island, I just waited and did that day to day without doing any time traveling. So, uh, but because I did all this time traveling, I had all these money trees that were growing. And for some reason I had this run where every single one of them was giving me lots of money, which is really rare. I, I don't know how I got that lucky, but 
I got this tree that had the 99,000 bells for each pocket. And then this one here also had, uh, this one didn't, this was 10. And then what was this one? I can't remember. If maybe with the recording, I only got, uh, yeah, that was just 10 as well. But before that, I was getting really lucky with a lot of them. So that's why I planted so many of them there. But this is another one of the Sanrio characters. She's the My Melody character. She's so adorable. So I knew I had to get her. So I decided to invite her as well and had the little red squirrel that I have, Caroline, leave. So um, this house seemed like it suited that the little deer guy, little deer girl. So I, I wanted to invite her to this house. Um, and so I had her leave and um, I have her card too, I think, or I can't remember, but I do have a lot of people's cards. So, um, so it was just neat to get to see all these people. When you invite the Sanrio characters, it also unlocks all of the items that they have in their house for you to buy. So that's really cool. You can only buy five things a day though. So, uh, but that's, he's the cutie that's from, um, Pom Pom Pudding too. So, uh, was able to get a lot of people, which was really great. Now, later on, on the 24th of March was Skye's birthday, which is cool. So I was excited to, uh, celebrate her birthday. I was kind of actually almost thinking if I was going to ask her to leave so I could make room for someone else, but I changed my mind because I really do like her and I'm glad I did. So it was her birthday and so we went to go see her and give her a present and stuff and um, I really like her uh, character and she's just so cute and pretty so I was glad to have her and be part of my island. Um, I think having played now for a year I was kind of okay a little bit more with letting some people go because um, I'd had them around so long and so I had Caroline leave and I had Wade leave and then I also had um, Stella leave too uh, to make room and also, uh, what's her name, the other squirrel over there. Um, I had all of them leave. I wound up bringing in four of the six. Um, <laughs> I almost brought in everybody of all of the people that are in the Sanrio's um, Amiibo series. I did not bring in the gorilla or the elephant. Um, the elephant's not that bad. She's kind of cute, but I was like, eh, no, I think I'd like to just stick with these guys. So we had a great celebration with Sky. She looked so cute there. So that was fun to get to take pictures there with her. And she's all so pretty and dressed up. And, um, since we're officially now like at the point where I've been playing for an entire year, um, I knew coming up after her birthday, then the next big holiday would be Easter. And um, I just knew getting ready for that, that I'd probably, uh, you know, I didn't know how much, if anything, would be different, but uh, it wasn't. There there was a few new items that were available for purchase at the store that I was able to get to make some nice decorations. But the challenge with the Easter Bunny was the same. So um, I just didn't bother obviously doing that and left it because I already had all of the recipes and everything for that. But it was a lot of fun to get things out there decorated and stuff. And like I said, with the Sanrio characters, I was able to get some cute uh, clothing as well. I have here on that t-shirt that was the Pom Pom Pudding t-shirt. And then that adorable little flower um, shower. That was just so cute. I got the recipe for that. That was fun. That has nothing to do with Sanrio. It was just really cute. So... Um, it was Easter and I was excited to kind of get ready for that, you know, with everything. And, um, as I got ready for stuff, I did put a few decorations out as I tried to accumulate stuff so that I could have things out. But on this day, as you can tell, we had a beautiful rainbow. So that was nice. Lots of rain and then sun and then rain and sun because it's springtime. Um, a lot of people don't like Zipper. I think he's kind of cute, but he's also a little crazy looking. But so uh, I had a lot of fun, you know, just seeing him around and doing stuff and collecting more eggs and things. Um, and really, I didn't do many things with the egg items. I just kept my collection going and, uh, you know, uh, left it kind of the way it is. But it was, it was still a lot of fun to get to celebrate this one more time. And like I said, they did have a couple of unique items, like this chocolate egg set. That was new. So I had that out after getting that from the store. And um, then it was just about inviting, you know, some of the other people that I wanted to invite. And um, so I decided to get, like I said, the dear girl that we saw earlier on here. And um, her name's Chelsea, I believe. 
And then the other thing I worked on was making some special stuff with all the Mario items that were part of all this new updates lately too. So I'll have a separate video that will show you guys what I did with all of those. So you'll want to check that out when you have a second. And, um, you know, that's pretty much all of March. And then we get ready for April and uh, the cherry blossoms will be back for a very short time. And... We'll move on to other things during that month as well. So I hope you guys are all having fun if you're playing and um, if you've been enjoying the new Sanrio characters too. Um, I'll have some more stuff to share with you guys in the days to come. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you all later. Bye!